weather with Tracy Hinson. Good morning, everyone. The radar is dry for now, but this is certainly going to change over the week. But what we are seeing this morning is a lot of clouds out there from the satellite view. You can see them moving in. This is due to a lot of moisture in the atmosphere. So take a look at the satellite loop. This is what's going to help feed our system that we're bringing in on Thursday. The whiter it is, the more moisture there is in the atmosphere, and you can see that subtropical moisture plume, and it is pointing right at us. This is bringing us all those clouds this morning, but this is going to be the hose that's really going to help to bring a lot of rain. Into our system as we bring in that system on Thursday. So, on the future cast, watch these ISO bars. Now, these are lines of equal pressure and they kind of act like the runway for rain. So, if they're pointed northwards like they are now, this is a ridge of high pressure. We're not going to see the rain, but they're going to slowly start to turn more perpendicular and point right towards us. Monday, we have a slight chance for a shower. Notice we are barely in the blue. Maybe Santa Cruz will get a little shower. If we get any rain, it won't be very much, but not the case for the system coming in on Wednesday. Wednesday by 11 p.m., this is going to be the first little bit of rain that we're going to get. We're right in the blue zone there, so we're going to get just a couple of showers overnight, and then Thursday, that hose is going to be on. That subtropical moisture really is going to help this system by just in time for the commute. Maybe you're going to pick up your kids. Maybe you're commuting from work. 3 p.m. on Thursday, heavy rain. Now, it's still only Sunday, so we do have some time for this forecast to change a bit, but Thursday by 3 p.m., a bullseye, a very heavy to moderate rainfall right over our area, so be careful for that on Thursday. Let's talk about the system in detail now. Santa Cruz and Santa Lucia Mountains expecting two to four inches of rain, could be five inches in the Santa Cruz Mountains by the end of this system. The Monterey Bay area, just about one to two inches. Some minor flooding is to be expected, as well as some strong to gusty winds, and this is usually the troublemaker of these systems. It knocks down power poles, trees, makes the roadways a mess, so gusty winds possible up to 50 miles per hour. Now on SkyCam 8 Monterey, it is clear, so that fog is very patchy at times this morning. There is a bank of clouds out there, and that's going to be the theme of the day. As far as temperatures go, not too bad. Everyone is just about the same this morning. 54 degrees in Monterey and just about everywhere else. So let's see if that fog is going to burn off later on today. You see it here just still hugging the coastline, really. So some spots may see fog and low clouds just about all day long. Then it'll fill again tonight. But the inland valleys, They'll clear out later on today. As far as temperatures go, mid 60s along the peninsula here, 65 in Monterey, 66 in Santa Cruz, 63 in Ben Lomond. And it'll be partly sunny skies today in the valleys. 68 in Gilroy, 66 in Hollister, 67 in Gonzales. Here's a look at your Monterey Bay marine forecast. We're talking surf 2 to 5 feet today, so not too bad out there with some fairly light winds. Your seven day forecast has 60s today, bringing in that storm system on Thursday. And this is going to be a colder one, so we're going to see a drop in the temperatures. And they're going to be a lot colder than the system we had moved through on Wednesday of last week. So this Thursday, get ready, get the sandbags out. If you had some flooding on Wednesday, you're going to have flooding again on Thursday. Your nighttime forecast, 40s and 50s just about all week long, could get a touch cooler on Wednesday as that system starts to come in. Now some holiday fun. The Watsonville holiday tree lighting going on today, 60 degrees at that. We'll call it mostly cloudy skies. Maybe a touch of fog as you come back from that. And uh, Bryn, the Monterey Boat Parade, always a fun so event. fun. It feels like Christmas out there. Even the cold weather, I sort of like during this time of year. So. It's not bad. Hot <laughs> chocolate, grab and head out there, yeah. watch the parade. It'll be a lot of fun. Thank you, Tracy.